I've been teaching English for a while now, and I wanted a, a chance to just teach theater and direct theater. And um, when we came and saw the town, we kind of fell in love with it. And um, so it was just a really, it was a good fit. Mm -hmm. We enjoyed all the people here at the school and everything. So and most of your theater experience out in West Texas, I guess. Yes. You were in college <laughs> out there. And yes. I came to TCU first. Oh, TCU. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I stayed there for a couple of years, and then North Texas, and then I graduated at Tech. Oh, okay. So, All right. Just kind of go back and forth a little bit. Now, we noticed a posting. Uh, you jump right in, and you've got an exciting musical that uh, we'll be talking a lot about more lately, later, I'm sure. Yes, yeah, so we're doing Shrek for our first musical. Uh, we wanted to do something fun and kind of different, but we wanted to do something that was kind of kid-friendly that we could do, you know, with the elementary schools. Um, invite them to come see it and also use some of the little kids to be in it as well. So, now, I know a lot of times in these musicals we've had a combination of the drama students and then some people from the community are involved. Do you see that kind of approach too? Um, possibly, yes. Uh, we, Our administrators seem to especially enjoy being in shows and Mr. Lamb and Mr. Um, Williams have both expressed interest in having a part. So <laughs> can't wait to see what we end up doing with them. But um, anyway. But you have already planned auditions uh, coming up, right? Yes. We'll have auditions September 2nd, the second week of school. So oh, okay. give the kids one week to get ready. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And uh, so uh, have you done Shrek before? Is this I have not done Shrek before. No, okay. this will be all new for everybody. So It's a fairly new musical. It's a pretty new musical. Yeah, the musical has only been around and the rights have only been around for a couple of years. So uh -huh. um, so that'll be fun. And no, I haven't had the chance to direct it before. So <laughs> that will be exciting. And I have a technical director to help me and that will be much more exciting too. I won't mm -hmm. have to um, worry about all the design and stuff as much. So that'll that's one good thing about this job too is now I have some someone to help me and a partner and stuff. So, so I would imagine uh, in a production like this, probably pretty interesting sets, costumes, or works. Yeah, yeah, the costumes just because everybody in it's a fairy tale character, so they're gonna <laughs> it's gonna look pretty interesting just from that. But yes, we'll have. Um, I haven't worked out all the details on the set yet, but we should have a, a rolling castle that comes in some mm -hmm. levels and forest, a lot yeah. of forest scenes. So, yeah, it should be pretty visually interesting.